Who knew such a small opening would lead to such a large space inside? Ah, what's that? Could it be? The sound of two powers resonating! My soul jam, and the soul jam of that beast! Ah! My sword is shaking more than ever! I can barely hold on! It feels as if something is trying to escape from within! Be calm, my sword! At least until I have defeated Mystic Flower Cookie! Oh, you who have finally made it to my place of sacred meditation. Heed my words. You are a being of resolution unparalleled, for no other power could bring you here, to the roof of the world. Should I combine such resolution with my apathy? The world shall become a void of white by my volition. I have heard enough of your apathy, Mystic Flower Cookie! I have climbed up this mountain with my bare hands, crumbling into flour, falling down, and getting back up again for one singular purpose. To turn you into nothing! Return! Let it go! Let it go! Let it go! My hand! The sword does not follow my command! If only it would stop trembling! Then I could defeat Mystic Flower Cookie and save my kingdom! Delusion. You, a false immortal and unworthy owner of the Soul Jam. Those who have realized the evanescence of time will heed your word no longer. You know nothing! Then witness the truth. Your Majesty, I feel so at peace. It's true, Your Majesty. We're no longer burdened with worry. Running through snowstorms in the mountains wasn't easy. I can see it now, Your Majesty. How much the burden of being born as a dark cacao warrior was weighing me down. I don't want to go back to the way things were. No. You cannot truly mean these words. We must protect our home, our kingdom together. The Dark Cacao Kingdom! What does the word kingdom mean to you? Kingdoms rise, then fall. History itself is proof that nothing lasts forever. They all burn to ashes, become swallowed up by invaders, or fall into anarchy. A kingdom is but a short moment in time. Why risk your life for something so... fleeting? Fleeting, you say? The Dark Cacao Kingdom is everything to me! I founded it with this very sword, trained magnificent warriors, and protected it against the licorice monsters! You cannot possibly fathom the responsibility I bear for my cookies and my kingdom! Your kingdom is everything, you say? 
Is that what you truly think? Yes! Very well, then. Witness your kingdom without you in the picture. This is an age of peace, don't you think? It seems like just yesterday that we were plagued by the pale ailment. But now, everyone has already returned to perfect health and is back to training. It is all thanks to the unwavering devotion of my subjects. No, it's all the merit of your new reign, your majesty. Since we reinforced the Great Chocolate Wall, According to your instructions, the licorice monsters are no longer a threat. While the giant icing ridge is safely protected by our noble cream wolves. It's the first time we've seen everyone so happy. What a relief that you took over the empty throne, your majesty. <laughs> it is as you say. The Dark Cacao Kingdom has never seen such peace and prosperity before. Yet, I cannot help but think of our late king, who crumbled away in foreign lands and never saw such glory of the kingdom. Where are you going, your majesty? I think I will go light some incense sticks to cherish his memories. At the altar of the fallen, where his name is etched into the stone. What is the meaning of this? What have I just seen? My own son, ruling the Dark Cacao Kingdom. Do you mean to say I crumbled away here, in this foreign land? Now do you see how your kingdom is but a moment in time, and your position within it even more so. Cookies always succumb to the power of the present, for that is how cookies are. You see your subjects pledging allegiance to the new king, Dark Choco Cookie, in your absence. The walls you have spent decades building, the countless attempts you have made to protect the kingdom from enemies. How long do you think your subjects will remember your efforts? The kingdom seemed fine without me. No, it was even more peaceful than before. For what reason did I climb this mountain? Why did I pour all my effort and energy into protecting my kingdom that I miss so dearly? Will anyone even notice if I crumble here? <sighs> How futile. Is this what apathy feels like? <laughs> 